going to look at a rather horrific murder scene and we're going to take DNA samples and we're going to try and find out from the DNA the culprit. I want you to tell me where you think you might be able to find DNA which would be useful. Who's, whose blood is it likely to be? Is there anything in the room which might suggest you that there might be another sample of DNA somewhere else? On the couch. So take some from the couch, a little snippet from the floor. We'll take the samples downstairs. We're going to put the DNA into a gel and we're going to do a process called electrophoresis. And so we pass a current through the DNA on a lump of jelly and the heavier the DNA, the slower it will move down the gel. And each of us, you, 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 me, you, all of us have a slightly different DNA. So we will see different bands for different people. We're going to give you the samples labelled C, which is the one from the crime scene, and the samples labelled A and B, which are from the two suspects. And you then load those into your gel, and then we're going to turn the current on. And as Professor Winston said, the DNA will move out and give you different patterns for different people, hey, look, and one you should be able to work out who did the crime. Right, stand back, let her get some light. Yeah, give me some air, guys. It is. That ain't in the right place. Do we need to? I'll oh, soon find out. That's done it. I'll tell you, I'm really bad at loading gels. I once said to one of my researchers in my lab, I'm going to come back and do some more work in the lab. And she said, look, please don't do that because you'll mess up all the gels. Ah. <laughs> that's it. Keep it level. Oh, that's, that's cancer. Look, terrific. Oh. Now come and follow it down. We'll have a look at it on the UV illuminator. Now, Jenny, I want you to tell me who the innocent person is from this gel. How am I meant to know? Because there were two DNA samples <laughs> at the crime scene. Yeah. One's a murderer yeah. and one's a victim. Right. So I want you to tell me, looking at the gels, who the innocent person is. Is the innocent person the one with all the... Yes. All of it? Good girl. Why is that, though? Because, because those two have got the same DNA. So that's one person? Uh, yeah. Cool, man. Is that how they find out in the police? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's cool, man. Do you want a photograph of it? Yeah, go for it. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, so we can share that to the judge. It weren't me, I can prove. <laughs>